All right, guess what day it is today? It's not Friday, if you're wondering that. It's the 1st of April, and uh, oh, guess what? We get some April Fool's weapons for you. All right, so three new weapons came out today for the April Fool's update. Let's check out the first one. It's the PGM Hikate 2, which is an anti-material rifle that's somehow stuck to the wall now. Thank you. Got a magazine, fires 50 BMG. Oops, that was my uh, phone, don't worry about that. Bolt action, obviously. Does not have a bipod. There's a safety, it's on the right or left thumb pad. Cool. Anything else I should know, maybe I'll find out. Oh, touchpad down is to release the magazine. Let's put a scope on this thing, which is not really useful here because, well, <laughs> there's not much room to fire it, but I'm just going to fire it anyways. Okay. Seems like there's no, um, whatchamacallit, when you can press the uh, right touchpad to, uh, to uh, you know, act activate the bolt here. You have to do it manually, just like the... M200. I guess the bolt is a big chunky bolt. You can't do that with the, uh, what I'm talking about here. Hold on. Let me show you what I mean. Let's go to bolt action. Let's go, let's do the standard, this one. All right. I don't need to fire it that much, but see, I have both hands on the gun. If I press right on the touchpad, I can uh, manually or um, automatically get the bolt, right? Even though I'm left-handed, that doesn't make any sense. You can't do that with these guns, so <clears throat> yeah. Oop. So yeah. Oop. Ah. All right. Oh yeah. Forgot. <laughs> can't do that. <laughs> that shouldn't be like that, but, uh, whoa, this gun is so large, hitting the top of this, uh, this doorway here. Look at that. <laughs> I was just testing the uh, amount it needed. You can't fire it, say, <clears throat> when the bolt is up like that. But if you just put it down a bit, obviously you couldn't do that in real life, but, you know, this is virtual reality. You can do whatever you want, within reason. I'm not really aiming at anything because there's really nothing to aim at. I don't know why. Hold on. Let me just fix that by adding some sausages. All right. Well, you know. Oh. This should uh, blow its head off. Whoa! Go through that armor. Oh yes, it definitely does. How about that? Well, it went through that armor. It didn't blow it up. And it's dead. <laughs> Just died from internal bleeding. Hold on. Let's lower the magnification a bit. That's one thing I don't like about virtual stock, is the fact that when you move your head, the gun moves. But that's just part of the virtual stock, so I mean, it makes it better, but you can't just like, use your other eye to aim. See, now you're missing. Oh, I was targeted on his, uh, on the Sausage's head right here. But when I look over to the side, yeah. Well, you know, I mean, the virtual stock is pretty much a, you know, a godsend. It's a blessing. So, I'll take it. Whatever flaws it has. I'm gonna shoot through the helmet here. Oh. Blew his head off. Let's see. Hold on. Can I put a suppressor on this thing? I don't think so. But you never know. <clears throat> Let's go with the biggest one that they have. The Uzi. 
<laughs> no, definitely. Most definitely you can't add a suppressor. Is that a rail? Huh, that is a rail. What can I put down there? A little reflex sight. <laughs> yeah, that's that's kind of bad. Hold on. Whoa, that was a nice little deflection there. All right, so you can't put stuff down there. It's kind of hard to reach, though. I mean, this is like pretty much my wingspan. I'm about six foot, so <laughs> this is a pretty big boy. Right up here to my chest. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. What else can I do with this thing? I can't put a suppressor. Uh, nothing else I can put on this thing except for maybe some joke stuff. antlers on there whoa hey now oh wait hold on I gotta reach over and grab this thing there we go <laughs> give a new meaning to Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer oh this is a massive gun look at that well all right there's two more other guns out there so I better uh, spawn those and try them out let me just empty this. And uh, into the bin you go. <clears throat> and let's spawn our new, other new guns, which are all in the anti-material uh, section. Even though this, I don't think, is anti-material. But it is a, the Triple Regret. A 50 caliber BMG... Revolver. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Well, we've got one in the chamber. Ooh. That is massive. Hold on. Oh. You're not going to die? Are you dead? Oh, no. Still alive. Oh, only three rounds, as you can see. Three rounds of 50 caliber goodness. Oh, I hit the armor. I doubt you can put a suppressor on this thing. Wow. Just this, those, the sound of those shells just hitting the ground. Oh, I missed. Oh. Huh. I want to see if I can put some attachments on this thing. Let me see. Hold on, wait a minute. I just want to make sure I'm not hitting my walls here. <sighs> I doubt you can put a suppressor on this thing, but hey, this isn't going to stop me from trying. Now, as usual with most revolvers, you can't. But, can you put a sight on this thing? Let's see. Stick a game point on top. No. Okay. I don't think you can. Hmm. That would be really nice, though. But you can't. Which is fine. I mean, it doesn't really matter. To me, at least. I mean, this is a 50 caliber BMG. The size of these bullets. Look at that. That is insane. Oh, sorry. There we go. Hold on. 
I'm just gonna find a Salsig and I'm going to fire as many rounds as I can possibly get without aiming. See if I can hit it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no. Just hit the ceiling there. Now, you really need to space out your shots because the recall on this thing is just insane. Still didn't manage to get that saucy. Oh, no, he's dead. <laughs> Died from extreme trauma and blood loss. Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. Huh. Ooh, right in the body. One more. Oh, wonder if I can get two of them in one shot. I got one. Is the other one dead? Yep, the other one is dead. Wow, that is powerful. <laughs> Just run up to them. All right. Now, if we could only put a scope on this thing, that would be <clears throat> pretty cool. I just want to try one thing before we go, though. Uh, to the next weapon. Oh, no, that's not the one I want. I want the Mauser. Yes, okay. This will work. Let's play all the sausages. Spawn a couple more. I think accuracy and recoil is better managed when you put a stock on this big, bad thing. Let me just uh, fire it. All at once here. Yep. You get better accuracy if you have a stock on this thing. So I can pretty much just go. I mean, if I don't manage to kill them, they'll be in some serious pain. Alright, so yeah, put a stock on this thing. That'll work. Oh, man. Anton, you crazy crazy guy. All right. Well, that's enough of that. The triple... What's it again? Regret? All right. So the final weapon is the Whizbanger. And, um... Yeah. Nope. Well, did I not get a 50 cal? Oh. Well, anyways, the, this one is basically a... Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to explain the history of this without sounding a little... Uh, too nerdy, but, well, 4chan made some, uh, well, they found out about this, this thing called Pimp, Pimp My Gun, right? By, uh, what's his name? Dr. Noob. He created this, uh, flash, uh, game that you could, you know, just make different guns and stuff. It was a pretty cool novelty back then. I used it. A lot of other people used it. And, uh, well, you know, 4chan got a hold of it, and they decided to make their most uh, <laughs> outlandish creations. And this was one of them. It didn't have a name, but uh, for Anton, I guess he decided to call it the Whiz Banger. Hold on. I need to get a actual cartridge for this. Oh. Come on. There we go. So, this one fires 50 caliber BMG uh, Browning machine gun hold on 50 right Browning machine gun and we are going to do AP incendiary come here so basically the operation of this weapon is you take a round you stick it somehow into that thing take your little hammer And uh, you try to aim it, and you hit it. Ooh, I got him. First try. Oh, wait, no, he's still alive. Oh, you don't even need the hammer. You can just hit the, the uh, firing pin on the wall here, which, uh, I wonder if I drop it. Oh, okay, yeah. There you go. Acts just like the 
what should we call it? The, um, oh my god, I can't believe I forgot it. It's a revolver. It's, um, hold on, wait a minute. The Colt. The, uh, damn it. <laughs> Single action army. There you go. Yeah, it's been a while since I used it, so. But yeah, so you can take the hammer. Hit it. Oh, got to take off the shell. Stick that on there. I guess, I mean, it might be really good for close quarters battle. <laughs> Stick another one on there. You could get two saw sigs. Oh, uh, didn't mean to do that. It's pretty sensitive. But yeah, like I said, you can get two saw sigs with one hit. Oh, no, I missed. <laughs> Try that again. Oh, I missed. There we go. Oh, he doesn't die, but... Well, you can probably beat him with a hammer. <laughs> ah! Alright. Just gonna do this one more time. This ain't gonna hurt much. <laughs> All right, so it looks like it has a rail in the bottom. I'm going to check out what I can put there. Obviously, I'm going to try to put a suppressor on it. No, <laughs> no, it's not gonna work. So there's a rail. I could put a laser if I wanted to. Let's see, tactical laser one? Yeah, this will work. Or maybe? Nope. I don't think this rail works. Huh. That... That is, uh, yeah, no, because this is a foregrip, basically. It's a, it's a foregrip that goes underneath... Uh, it's one of... Hold on. Let me see, hold on. No, I don't think they have that specific model, but this is the one that has, like, this rail here, so you can put lasers and stuff on it. But yeah, this is a foregrip. And I guess uh, the rail isn't modeled, so you can't put a rail on there. It's, uh, you know, whatever. I don't care. <laughs> the absurdity of this weapon, you know, is enough. You don't need to, you don't need to add more to it. Oh, nice. Well, this guy's not going to die, but yeah, you know. Completely improbable weapon. You really don't want to see this on the battlefield because either <laughs> the person is crazy or they're stupid. But, you know, whatever. If it works, it works. You're going to sneak up on a guy. You know, get behind him, pull out your tiny little hammer, boop. <laughs> All right. Well, that is pretty cool, I guess. I love it. If you know anything about uh, memes, you'll see this one a lot because it's so, <laughs> it's so dumb. Let's just throw that away. It's a nice hammer, though. Actually, hold on. Let me uh, go back and grab one of these. Just the hammer itself. And uh, we'll just do regular. Whoops. 50 BMG. Spawn single. Oh, nope, that is 50 AE. I wanted that one. Oh, no. Actually, I actually want to try something before I leave. Uh, no, before I leave this, I want to try something. But then I want to try something else before I stop this video. There was one other thing that Anton decided to add. And that was... Where is it? Nope. 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 Here we go. Saucy clowns. So, 
these guys don't have it right now, but if we clear them and we spawn them. Wait, did it actually load? Oh, nope, there it did. Yes, we have clown sausage now. If you have a fear of clowns, I don't know what it was. Was it chorophobia? <laughs> I don't know. But if you have a fear of clowns, they're big red noses, then uh, you probably wouldn't like this. But I think it might be cathartic because you can then kill them. And then rip them apart. Oh, and they die with a lot of confetti. So, yeah, you know. Have them wander fight. Hmm. Are they, uh, are they my enemy? Oh, they don't have any weapons, huh? Um, give them lots of knives. And, uh, yeah. Now they're coming after me. And, oh! <laughs> some of them managed to find some, uh, weapons. No. Get away from me. I need to take them out. No. Gonna get you. Huh? Dog meat, ah, get away from me. Get, get away from me! I think I understand why some people are very afraid of clowns. Get a grab! Uh, no, get away from me! No clown with a shotgun! Die, clowns. Die. Die, all you clowns. Okay. <laughs> Man. Ah. Just for good measure. You never know when these guys come back up from the dead. Gotta burn them with this flamethrower. I forgot how this worked. Oh, there we go. Every time they die, they make a party noise. Make sure you destroy every last one of them. Oops, got the dogs barking outside. They're suspicious of clowns, too. <laughs> Gotta destroy them. <sighs> yeah, there we go. So that's uh, the April Fool's update. Uh, very cool, very funny new guns, and of course, clown sausages. Okay. Uh, Alright, that's about it for today. I'm just going to 
Stop the video right now.